Do you struggle to perform skill moves in PES Mobile? Do you want your favorite player to go brrr and score screamers like this? <laughs> then watch this tutorial video till the end. Double touch. Alright, so here's the tutorial for double touch. This is probably one of the most requested tutorials on my channel and one of the most useful skill moves in this game. A lot of people are abusing that. It is very effective. It is quite direct, quite straightforward. Speaking about online matches, it is a little bit harder to do just because of the input lag. So in online matches, I would recommend you actually to use it sporadically in the situations when it is required. So first and foremost, let's check out the mechanics of the double touch. Let's check a player who has the double touch skill. Fernando Torres has also scotch move skill that is quite frustrating to have at the same time with the double touch, but I'll be covering that a little bit later in the video. So let's have Maradona who has only double touch skill when you're swiping the uh, joystick directly. So how it works, just tap dash and swipe at the direction that your player is running. And he will be doing that croquetta and he's gonna be changing the like a lane change it was also a name for that in fifa i believe so a uh, very effective move i actually use that in real life football as well uh, very fun to beat your opponents straightforward if your opponent is directly uh, running at you rushing you this is the situation where you'd want to initiate that so one more time dash swipe in the direction of your run so if you run this way swipe it you'll be getting yourself a double touch. While it is very effective, you need to make sure that you are initiating it, trying to perform the double touch, especially online games where your opponent is actually gonna be rushing you. Whenever your opponent is trying to press you, either with a player that is controlled by him or the player that is uh, controlled by double pressure, the timing is crucial here, so you need to have like about half a meter, I would say, distance from a player before trying that. If you try that very late, you'll be tackled. If you try that very early, you can be in a situation when you have already performed a double touch move, where you didn't go past him and he can easily just stick a leg uh, and uh, get the ball from you. So it will be an embarrassment for you if you did that uh, double touch move and you still didn't beat your opponent. This is, I would say, one of the most consistent skill moves in this game, one of the moves that you need to learn. And it's quite easy, quite straightforward, just tap and dash and uh, click on the direction where you're running and you'll be easily initiating that double touch. Let's talk about the other skill move, which is very fun. By fun is I mean that I would rather not have that skill move at all. Not the croquetta, but this one. Flicking move that is called the scotch move that I hate with passion because it is one of the most useless skill moves in this game. It is very showoffish. Uh, the problem with that is because naturally you can see you're running straight at your opponent like a moron. If you're performing that, if you want your player like Fernando Torres, please, for the love of God, perform double touch for me and he's performing that move you're running straight at your defender opponent's defender and uh, you're being tackled straight away it is not a move that can initiate some kind of nutmeg situation usually and it is not a move that allows you to create some free space it is the biggest downside of this move but uh, the advantage of Konami's system uh, that actually performs nutmegs for you sometimes it is actually taking into consideration the placement of your opponent's defender sometimes and whenever you're doing you're trying attempting to perform a move that has coincidentally the same controls as your double touch. Konami may be initiating double touch instead of this flicking scotch move that I hate with passion and I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys hate as well. So there are players like Azard who have only a scotch move and no double touch so you know for sure that he's gonna be performing that one and you can use that as a show move. Training a player scotch move probably not the best idea or if you're uh, playing with a player who usually does this instead of double touch you probably would want to uh, maybe re <laughs> reconsider your selection uh, next time. But still, you do you fam. Uh, my goal here is just to share uh, the techniques, the tutorial for these skill moves. I hope you found this tutorial useful. I hope you can now beat your opponents online easily. And uh, if you want to learn some other skill moves, check out the playlist in the description below. That's it from me and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.